and welcome back to my channel. I'm Jessica and today I have my finale for Graveyard Project Pan. Kind of sad about this because I really like this project. This was created by Emily aka Emily and Max. Uh, this is the second year. I'm pretty sure this is the second year. Maybe it's the third and I missed the first one. I don't remember. I think that's what happened. I think this is technically the third year and I missed the first one. Um, basically, anyway, about the project. It started on April 30th, ends on Halloween. Yes, this is going up a day early because I have another intro that actually starts tomorrow. And um, it's not going to make a difference anyway. So, Graveyard has two categories. Uh, or Graveyard Project Pan has two categories. It actually has Graveyard category and it has the Collecting Cobwebs category. Graveyard category is a product that has been in a painting project before and you were not able to um, finish it or meet your goal, whichever the case may be. And the Collecting Cobwebs category, which is most of my entire collection, is stuff that is really old and just needs to get used up because it's like in your collection just sitting there collecting cobwebs. So, yeah. I have a lot of collecting cobweb stuff, but, but I have a couple less this time. So let's get into this. Um, I do have some empties this time. However, I was not hundred percent effective on this project. I feel like I did okay though. So I am not mad about it. I just, I was hoping to finish this one product before the finale. Just didn't happen. I'm okay with it. Um, so I'm going to show you my empties first, um, in the graveyard category. This was a lotion bar. This was in another project. I never actually touched it. It is done. Sorry about the glare. It smells so good. Um, this time of year, as the weather's getting colder, I, I have to put something heavy duty on my legs, especially, but like on my body, my arms and stuff like that. Um, or I will scratch so bad that I bleed. We're not quite at that point yet in the year, but as it gets colder and colder in the air, it gets drier and drier. Yeah. It's an absolute necessity. So I have started using the heck out of that and I was able to finish it up and uh, move it out. It's always good to move things out. And then um, I have empties from the collecting cobwebs category. I brought both of these three in last update and I knew I was gonna get them finished. There are three foil samples from Avon. It's their Moisture Lift Protective Cream SPF 15. It's basically a slightly SPF'd version of um, like a moisturizer. Not enough SPF to really do a whole lot, but um, yeah, that was easy to get through those, so those are done. One remaining product not finished, and it is actually being rolled into the project that you will see tomorrow. I have not filmed that intro yet, but I will be filming it soon, and um, this product is going to be rolled into there in honor, actually, of this particular project, so be on the lookout for that. All right, the last remaining product in here is a graveyard product. This has been in two other projects and I still haven't finished it. Oh, it's the pinky glitter. There is not much left. If I like get it all down at the bottom, you can see there's like the tiniest little bit left. It was like, I guess up to here when I started and then down to here. I actually do have it on a bunch of my nails today. Like here, here, here. Um, I just... I just couldn't finish it. Even if I did the the accent nails, like the the ones that I have green in this pinky glitter, it was would not be enough to finish this, and um, kind of makes me sad. It really does because it's so stinking close. But it's not done. So again, look for this to be rolled into the project that we'll be introing tomorrow. And um, yeah, I think that's everything for this update. There's going to be links galore down below if you want to check everyone out. I highly recommend you do because. There's lots of amazing people that did this project this year, so I'm pretty daggone sure this is coming back next year because this is a recurring project, and um, I'm definitely going to be doing this again next year because this is right up my alley because I have so much old stuff. So definitely check out some people down below. Please don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, and until I see you on my next video, have a beautiful day.